这样我们就考虑到这个怎么样去利用这个路面现有上面的空间，这样的话呢，呃，来减少这个路面的交通拥堵。呃，地铁大家知道它的运力和地铁是差不多的，但它的成本，地铁会是地铁的十分之一。Greetings, Green Going viewers, and welcome to Golden Age Technology on Supreme Master Television. As economic growth fuels urbanization, cities are actively seeking to enhance their mass transportation infrastructure to serve growing numbers of residents while reducing vehicular traffic and its associated pollution. Common modes of urban mass transit include subway, light rail, train, and bus, with each having their advantages and limitations. In today's program, we will introduce a novel transport solution that addresses the many challenges facing existing public transportation systems and helps better our environment. The solution is called an elevated high-speed bus, straddling bus, or the 3D Express Coach, a vehicle which is currently under development by Shenzhen Huashi Future Parking Equipment Company of China. The electric-powered bus has its passenger compartment positioned approximately two meters above the roadway, allowing small and medium-sized vehicles to pass underneath it. Therefore, the straddling bus does not take space away from roadway traffic while it is either moving or stationary. In May 2010, a small-scale model of the elevated high-speed bus was exhibited at the 13th Beijing International High Tech Expo. The same year, the bus was selected as among the 50 best innovations of 2010 by the renowned U.S.-based news magazine Time. The 3D Express Coach is the brainchild of Mr. Song Youzhou, chief executive of the Shenzhen Huashi Future Parking Equipment Company. A prolific inventor, Mr. Song has devised over 120 inventions over the years, including a unique roadside stacked parking system for cars. Let's now meet Mr. Song and find out what inspires his wonderful creativity. 平时呢，就喜欢自己喜欢去观察一些事物，这是属于看电视。其实有的事件也是一样，看到了一个事件，这事件会出现了一些问题，但怎么样去解决这个问题？是还是在观察。那比如说这个呃立体快八，您是怎么就是有什么灵感？灵感对。立体快八是这样的，主要就是因为我本身现在呢在深圳呢有一家有两家公司专门解决停车难的这么个专业公司，在搞市场调查的过程中呢，呃也经常被堵在路上，呃这样的话呢就想到了我现在搞停车是利用绿化带，利用城市的环境空间，那解决交通拥堵可不可以利用空间？这样开始有构思，啊，也是在观察嘛，堵车了，感受到了，去观察，叫怎样来解决。实际上说白了就是这个搞发明、搞创新呢，去发现问题，这是第一了。第二个问题就是怎么样去解决这个问题，呃，这这这就是实实际上就是发明的灵感。Observing the current state of public transportation systems, Mr. Song identifies several issues. Now, this pollution problem is a global problem. Pollution and net zero emissions are the main topics of discussion at the moment. How to solve the pollution problem? The solution is to improve public transportation. The solution is to improve public transportation. 像公共交通里，这里包括就有地铁，呃，这个快速公交 BRT， 还有普通的这个燃油大巴等，这个这种公共交通方式。但是呢，这个这些交通方式呢各有利弊。你比如说地铁呢，它造价太高，建设这个施工周期又长；这个快速公交 BRT 呢，它需要拿出专门的车道来。这样的话呢，本来在本来道路就就紧张的情况下呢，这样使使道路交通会更加拥堵。再有呢，这个这个 BRT 快速公交呢，它还是一种碳排放比较高的一个燃油大巴。你看，现在普通的燃油大巴现在都是六六十人，每辆车装六十人。六十人呢，它这个呃二十辆人就一千两百人。但大巴的速度现在平均速度在十几公里，但这个立体快巴呢可以跑四十公里，就它的效率可以代替四十辆普通燃油大巴
呃它的效率，这样的话就可以减少这个四十辆燃油大巴的这个燃油的消耗。这个每一辆燃油大巴，它一年的耗费的这个呃汽油呃或者柴油呃二十一吨，这样的话呢就等于是一辆立体快巴上路以后，每年可减少八百多吨的。呃，这个燃料的消耗，地铁是一千四百人，它在一个一千两百人左右，但它的造价呢，其实是地铁十分之一。地铁造价呢，每公里应该在五到八个亿，呃，而且这个立体快巴呢就便宜了，它是每公里的造价，包括路面的改造，包括机车等，综合造价每公里在五千万左右。What are the straddling buses specifications and the requirements to implement its use above roads? This linear quad bus design must have four or three bus lanes, about six meters wide. The height is four meters. The total length is four meters. This linear quad bus is divided into four sections. The width of the length is ten meters. The width of the length is ten meters. The width of the length is ten meters. 这个两米以二上面的空间是在载客，呃，这是驾驶室，能看到，这里面有楼梯。它这个立体快巴呢，横跨两条行车道，这两条行车道，这两条行车道呢，这个把轿车最矮的轿车和这个立体快巴呢，呃，整合到这两条两条快车道上来。这边这两条行车道呢是走这个大车的，能看到，走大车和特种车的，呃，这样的话就是啥呢？把这个把这个这个。大巴呢，侧面呢变成是这个这很薄的这个腿，这样的话就减少路面的占用，这样足够，这样的保证这个这个这个两条行车道足够的空间。这个快巴在运行的过程中呢，就不影响到其他车的通行，像这轿车在底下，完全像隧道一样，不隧道一样可以穿过。As the 3D Express coach is elevated above the road surface, how do passengers enter and exit the bus? This is a linear bus equipped with a bridge platform. Ah, up and down. Below there is a ladder. The ladder opens and closes from the bridge. It is a bridge and it is a bridge. So it is completed by using this way to complete the bridge class. 呃，就是他在上下课的过程中，这个车在底下不受影响，就完全可以在底下就照样通行，这就是它的一个最大的特点。The straddling bus can replace many conventional city buses, and keeping 40 such buses off the road is equivalent to avoiding 2,640 tons of CO2 emissions per year. A major contribution to a cleaner urban environment. It is truly a green mode of transport, as the vehicle burns no fossil fuels and thus emits no greenhouse gases. The electric bus is made of two types of charging mechanism. One is using solar energy. Oh, that's amazing. The roof is made of solar energy. 这个太阳能上面这个这个光伏板呢，就可以收集一些太阳能，呃，可以这个补充一下市政电力。这样的话呢，还有一个就是，我可以在在这个在这个人行道上铺上这个像这种这种凉亭，既可以遮阳，又可以的铺设上太阳能板，哎、呃，给采集太阳能，尽量去多采用太阳能。这样的话呢，就是它会减少这个市政电力的依靠，的能源的消耗。呃，供电供电方式有两种。一种呢是超级电容的，这个快巴在到站台的时候呢，它会自动充电，呃，上下课一分钟左右的时间就能把电充的跑到下一个站，这是一种方式。另一种方式呢，它是供电式的，一边一个一边一个，至少有导轨。这个不用超级电容的时候，用这种直接供电，呃，它属于接力式供电供电设施，呃，直给式，它取消了现有这个呃一些城市的一些呃有轨电车和无轨电车上面那个线。因为它影响生活环境嘛，这种只要看到这个桩，像像像这个灯杆一样，呃，接触了这个以后，它就充电了，呃，就给电了，直接供电。一个桩到了另一个桩直接供电。对，它每个桩的之间距离是四十米，快巴应该总长度三十米，呃，四十三米。像这样第一个接触上以后，它快巴继续往前走，呃，还有最后这个还没有断的时候，第一个第二个又接触上，它是始终是这样接力式。
The 3D Express Coach also has several impressive safety features. It is equipped with laser scanners to detect vehicles that are running too close to it and sends warning signals. It also has radar and ultrasonic detectors at the back to identify approaching oversized vehicles and deny their entry if needed. Before making turns, turn signals below and behind the bus will warn passing cars ahead of time. In the event of an accident caused by a vehicle in the roadway below, the straddling bus's passengers are protected from direct impact because the passenger compartment is elevated. If riders need to exit the 3D Express coach in an emergency, they would utilize devices much like the emergency evacuation slides aboard airplanes. It is envisioned that straddling buses would improve traffic conditions considerably, with the Shenzhen Huashi Future Parking Equipment Company projecting the system could reduce traffic jams by 20 to 30 percent on main routes. Mr. Song's company has received permission from Beijing's Mantogou district to build a 9-kilometer test route for the straddling bus along the West 6th Ring Road and has received orders for the bus from Spain and Brazil. A prototype of the bus is expected to debut in July 2011. The 3D Express Coach is a promising model of mass transit's future. Mr. Song Yojo, we sincerely thank you for explaining your amazing invention to us in detail. May your innovative transportation solution soon prove to be a great success and benefit many people. For more details on the 3D Express Coach, please visit www.hsfuture.com. Inspired viewers, thank you for your wonderful presence on this week's edition of Golden Age Technology. Up next on Supreme Master Television is Vegetarianism, the Noble Way of Living, after noteworthy news. May your wellsprings of creativity be forever opened with heaven's infinite blessings. For more details, please visit www.suprememastertv.com forward slash G-A-T